<laughs> you want real coins? Do the things, man. Seas has been getting a lot of reworks, a lot of work done. Not just that, we're working with different groups as well for Nindon, Relsies, and we just created a new group for Shinobi Life 2. Productivity on all these games aren't gonna stop. There's different uh, teams creating these products with us. And we'll fill you guys in and we'll tell you uh, everything because we've been going for a while. But the thing is, we haven't just been showcasing development. We're so ahead that there's a lot to showcase and you guys are gonna see a bunch of videos dropping from now on we still have a lot to do with this game and uh, a big part of it is gonna be on July 29th so uh, one there's gonna be an event uh, the Riken bloodline uh, we work and there's gonna be a skin for the Riken bloodline uh, the rail bloodline is coming as well uh, but most of all what you guys are looking at is uh, like the new kind of uh, map that's dropping, right? It's it already released it a while ago, but it, there's been improvements on the map. You know, there's less water, there's more land, uh, and all that good stuff, like all that nice stuff. It's a dark RP game mode uh, where you can turn PVP on, off. Uh, we really thought of everything. You get paid uh, for different roles, and um, there's a lot of things with this game mode. Uh, there's pvp missions there's pve missions that you run with your friends there's a lot of dark rp kind of content in here um and it's taken away kind of from the traditional rpg mob grind into like more of a um a a, a dark like a uh role play dark uh, like a dark role play kind of design where it's more um interactive with the community and i know there's like a little community that enjoys like big maps and all so this this game mode is for you guys Ah. You must spell Q. Okay, so we're gonna show you guys some of the, the the commands in game. So you can do PvP on. So when we do PvP on, um, you can't hit players until they turn their PvP on, right? And then you see when the danger bar is, you can't just turn PvP off. Like uh, you have to wait until the danger bar uh, disappears. Now there's squad. Uh, if you're a Kage, you get special commands. You get like message commands. You get kick commands depending on if it's a private server or not. Um, and you also get C pad commands. So C pad is training commands, right? So you can put people through trainings. You can do uh, TMs, team match. You can put people through team matches if they're in the same village and they're a low rank. Q for missions, right? How did you spell it? I know you misspell it. Q U A like that. So you yeah. can see, um, you can Q for missions. Escort your squad member to the objective point. And when you're escorting yourself to that point, um like players slash if you're not doing it in a pvp missions uh npcs like the smart mobs that we created uh, a while back they're gonna attack you while you're doing your missions so it's there's a lot of pvp pve content that's in here okay dude there, this is a dark rp game mode designed in a uh, pvp slash pve way so you don't have to have your pvp on to rush uh to run missions uh, now there is the Akatsuki part if you guys read all the documents and not documents um all the information i put out the Akatsuki can attack players that are safe so uh if you if you uh if you're on the Akatsuki team you're you know you can attack players that are that are like they don't have the pvp on so there's like a lot of things towards the game mode uh, there's protection missions for the military uh, just all types of little things around wait we're gonna we're gonna sneak peek you guys some uh some of the rail bloodline so the rail bloodline actually you can get rail coins you can get money uh you can get xp you can get all that right the moves are not just damage moves these moves they give things back to the player or you can give things to your friends so we're gonna show you guys a little sneak peek uh, 
uh welcome back to welsies guys so you guys noticed the ui change you know uh it's been changed for a while you guys just haven't seen it uh, uh yeah guys we're not gonna be dropping a full-on movie uh we're probably gonna be dropping development vlogs throughout the months coming like every single month maybe at the end or somewhere near to the end we're gonna probably drop like a 20 to 30 minute video just updating you guys on what's happening inside rel c's and yeah just keeping you guys updated on the news all right, come on, let's uh, let's go. All right, where are we going? We got what are we gonna show them first. All right, <laughs> you want to just explore around this island? No, 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 not the whole island. Not the whole island. Not the whole island. Okay. Hey, man, me and my giant ass crab. You know what I'm saying? And jump over everything. <laughs> Different types oh. of materials for everything, right? So you guys see like the new sand. You see the new rocks. Uh, even even check out the clothes. Let me let me get a zoom in on the clothes. You know what I'm saying? There's materials on the clothes just look at the leather boots and all that so even the hit oh even there's materials on the here as well there's materials on the mask it's it just like the little detail details there come here you know you know the gra the gra uh, as you guys say graphics oh, like graphics oh it seems like a good day you know what i'm saying just to leave dude that that's uh, that beautiful. That, that is, that is peak quality. All right, so guys, this is what we've been doing for Rel C's. Remember, this is not an official showcase. This is not even a trailer. This is just, uh, basically, this is like a mini vlog inside this video. Um, we're also going to be talking about Nindon and Shinobi Live 2 uh, as well. Now, before we leave you guys, right? uh you want to sneak peek them one of the little songs that you know so the game has about like 20 to 30 custom songs being created for it so we're gonna sneak peek you guys a little a, just a little tiny preview Now, uh, one big thing is we're deciding on if we want to do a Roblox-based body or a realistic anime-like body, right? And it's hard. It's hard which one we lean on, uh, but we're letting you guys vote. So there's going to be uh, Roblox-based bodies, and then there's going to be realistic anime-like bodies. So you guys can now vote down here. <laughs> 